Hi guys, my name is Zeman and I'm very happy to see you again in my channel. So, I've got many questions about the technical analysis. Many of you really wonder how to define the levels on the chart and I'm gonna show you everything in detail. Today I will show you the situations where we will define the support and resistance levels to try to predict the price movements in the future and open the profitable trades. Actually, my my strategy really helps me because I've made many years of practice and I try to tell you the same that you have to practice many years, many months to understand how to feel the market because if you find your own strategy you will start making very good money. I am showing you my strategy just for uh, demonstration that you first of all do the first steps in trading and try to learn your own approach and if you want to start the really professional trading I'm inviting you to my close chat where I will support and help you to start this sphere you have to find the link in the description under this video and write to me the code or it private to my personal telegram messages and also you can write everything you want to my personal telegram messages I read the messages every day of course I got lots of them but I really choose the top Time for reading the messages for watching my chat it is very important for me because I am creating my membership my dream team of people we are inspiring together each other and it is very good and if you're ready to start out trading subscribe to the channel put your like and let's get it so hi friends today we will trade using a strategy based on technical analysis this is trading on support and resistance level and today I will show you how to determine the level and how to act in a given situation. So guys, let's start. So in this period of time, we can see that there was a very good and confident upward movement and also at certain points the price gave a reaction. There was a reversal and movement in the opposite direction. So here, let's select the horizontal line and put it at the upper values of these candlesticks. This is the highest point of this period of time. A little bit lower you can see the inner levels where the price also gave the reactions. Also you can see the general potential of the price that's going up. Also the price slows up becoming higher. The price has approached a certain level and then reversed. If you rewind chart to the left you will see that earlier the price didn't give any reaction at this level and it means that this level is not very strong and doesn't have very big resistance. So if the price still continues moving to this level and sticking, start sticking to it, so this is the dense formation of candlesticks in the, at the very level, yes? So this situation will tell us that in the near future this level will be broken through. So our test today is to find you know these situations and patterns that I have already met on the market many times. Exactly in such situations you have to open your transactions. In other words, if you don't understand or you don't know some situation, you just skip it. Try to determine for yourself exactly those situations in which you will be able to work out best. Perhaps it will be just the approach to the level or perhaps it will be the rollback from the level or maybe the best thing that you will be able to work out at the breakthrough of the level. We just try to avoid the risks. Of course, you understand that situations are different and the market cannot be just what you want it to be. Yes, that's why before trading, you have to check the historical data, understand how the price behaved a little earlier, at least, for example, last three hours. And after that, you use the strategy that I will show you today and thanks to it you will understand how the market behaves today and will it be okay for your strategy or you will need to use another way of trading. Of course in trading the very big uh, importance is your experience but if you practice a lot you try to feel the market you will get this experience. So today I will find these situations 
uh, that I know the best, as I told you. And I will tell you that uh, we will find different citations, but they will be quite similar to each one. And I will show you how I work out and how I determine these levels. So I want to warn you that no, this not all strategies are suitable for absolutely everyone because everyone should choose and understand what trading approach is the best for them. So to form market analysis, I always use 15 seconds time frame, and for me, this chart is very comfortable to read the market to understand and usually mainly I open my trades from one to three minutes depending on the situation. Here I set the horizontal line by the upper balance of these candlesticks and you can see that after the upper movement the price slowed down at the level and doesn't roll back from it but already going beyond it. So let's open a trade for one minute up. I think that in the near future this level will be broken through because the price is already going beyond this level. And recently the price has had very good potential for an increase. And in a similar situation, the price will break this level through. And even if the uh, complete breakthrough of the level doesn't happen, just the false breakout. In this situation, one minute will be enough. And I understand it thanks to my experience that I've made for years. Well, let's check what can happen here. Well, guys, now this trade is profitable and we got it. As you can see, the price moved up and then fixed over this level. This level is broken through, but this breakthrough uh, can be different. It may be the impulsive movement or it can be the slow but confident as in this situation. But the main thing is the result and we got the profit from this result and we can continue the next situation. So here you can see the resistance level at the top. This level is quite strong because the price has been bouncing confidently down. Right now the price is approaching this level third time. And here I will open a trade for two minutes down. The price has been approaching it and now it is a tuneation happening. You see that the candlesticks are decreasing. And here in this situation, I suppose that in the near future there will be the retracement movement. This will be the pullback down. The price has been moving quite slowly and I think that this time will be enough in this situation. Well, let's check it. So guys, it is very good. As you can see, the price got to the retracement zone. This was the pull back down. So this situation was worked out perfectly well. We can continue. So here you can see the resistance level at the top. And you can see from the upper point there was the reversal. And after a while, the price is again approaching this level. And this general potential is going up and to the resistance level there is some place. Well, let's open a trade for two minutes up because the price has the amazing potential for an increase and I am sure the price will move up to this level. Also in this situation there can be the flat zone or the pullback down and that's why I put it for two minutes with the reserve because in such situations two minutes are usually okay and also my experience of trading confirms me this entry point. Well, guys, it's quite interesting. The price really moved up and we got the profit here. So this situation is very good and amazing one. You are remembering it. Let's continue. So here, this is the support level at the bottom. You can notice that the price has approached this level and is going beyond this level already. Here, I will open a trade for one minute down because the price has been moving quite impulsively and I suppose that this level will be broken through because I cannot see any bounces up and it is already the second touch of the level for last 15 minutes and also the general potential is going down and as a rule 
one minute is enough for these citations and I just was thinking that we will get to this impulsive movement and at the moment of opening a trade the red very good candlestick appeared well let's check it so that is very interesting the price really moved down and this level is broken through we got the very good and amazing profit so that is very good trading let's continue after a while you can see this is the new support level appeared and this citation really repeats the price is going beyond this level and the general potential is going down so let's open a trade for one minute down and in this situation we got to the impulsive movement of the price down as it was the previous situation yes so the golden rule of the trading that everything repeats you just need to understand it in time so one minute in this situation will be enough and let's check what can happen here So guys it is very good as you can see the price really broke through this level we got the profit here the price has a very good potential for a decrease let's continue so here you can see the resistance level at the top and you can notice that from this level there has been the bounce and after a while the price again approached this level and was already going beyond this. The price lows are becoming higher here and this is the sticking to this level of resistance. So in this situation I will open a trade up for one minute because I think that in the very near future this level will be broken through because I cannot see the very big pullback from this level and it is already the second touch of the level for last 10 minutes and also the price has the amazing potential for an increase i can see that due to the chart and i'm sure the price will break through this level and we need to check it so that is very interesting the price really broke through this level then moved higher so we got the profit here so the similar situation really repeats and you will find them in your own practice i'm sure so we're in the same currency pair after some time so here you can see that this is the new resistance level appeared and from this level there has been the bounce and now the price is again approaching it and is already going beyond it so here i will open a trade again for one minute up because i think that this level will be broken through again because here this is the sticking to this level and we need to check what can happen here So that is very interesting, so it has been the slight pull back down, but then the price moved up and then broke through this level, so we got the profit here again, the price has been moving quite slowly but confidently and it is a very good potential for an increase as well, well let's continue. So here this is the support level at the bottom and you can notice that the price has been moving down very confidently towards this level and at the level the price is slowing down but there is some place to this level let's check if we open a trade down for two minutes and i think the price will move to this level two minutes also with the result because if we uh, face the flat zone or the pullback up we will be ready for that but the price really moved lower with very good and confident red candlesticks and i guess that this time will be enough and let's check it so that is very good as you can see the price really moved lower this level is broken through now and we got the amazing brilliant profit so the price really has this potential for a decrease and this situation really proved it so it is very good let's continue well guys here you can see the support level again and you can notice that the price touched this level then bounced up 
and after a while the price reversed and now is moving down so this potential is going down so in this situation i will open a trade for two minutes down because to the support level there is some place and in this situation there is a high chance that the price will be moving down and this time two minutes will be enough for that even if the, we face the flat zone here So it is very interesting, the pullback up happened, but then the price moved lower, moved down, we got the profit, so 2 minutes were enough for us. Well, let's find the next situation. So here you can see the support level at the bottom, and you can notice the price touched this level, then bounced up, and now the price is again approaching this level. The price highs are becoming lower, pay attention to this. To the support level there is some place, and here I will open a trade for 2 minutes down. The price is likely to be moving towards this level, and right now you can see the pullback up happened, and that's why I've open this trade with the reserve for two minutes i was expecting some situations the same ones and but the general trend is going down and that's why i think that the price will be moving down because this is the sticking to this level and i'm sure there will be the break too why not So it is very interesting, the price moved to this level and we got the profit. We worked out the perfect situation with approaching the level, so let's continue. So here you can see the support level and you can notice that after the flat zone the price exited this and now the price is confidently moving to this level, so there is some place and here we will open again the trade down. The price has very good potential for a decrease lately and I think that 2 minutes will be enough for that and in the near future the price will be moving lower. So let's check what can happen here. So that's amazing guys, the price moved lower and it's been there sticking to this level and the breakthrough of the level as well. So let's find the last situation for today because you know that the trading is about the discipline and the trading plan. So let me find something very interesting. So I run my chart and I can set the level due to the lower values of these candlesticks, then I am returning and here you can notice that it's been very good downtrend and also the false breakout happened, this is the place where the wicks go beyond the level. But also the general price highs are becoming lower here. Here I will open a trade for 2 minutes down. And I think that in the near future the price is likely to be moving down and break through this level. Because here I can see this is the downtrend and due to the historical data the price touched this level several times. And this is the sticking to this level and I think the price will break it through and the pullback up happened and that's why I've opened a trade with the reserve because I was expecting these uh, actions but the price is moving quite confidently and that's why I think that the breakthrough will definitely happen So guys, it is very good. As you can see, the price really moved down, broke through this level as we analyzed that. So my deposit is $5,000 and I will stop for today. All the citations were amazing, were very interesting and the main thing here, I know them the best. I showed you the citations that I was sure in and I recommend you to uh, collect to find to remember such situations for yourself that will be definitely profitable now we've made very good trading with technical analysis it's the classic trading with the support and resistance levels and i hope that you 
found some very valuable things for yourself that you have written down all the moments that you find necessary and already in 10 or 20 minutes you will go practicing and trading because you know it is very important for everyone to start doing something during the first 24 hours not tomorrow not in one week but during these 24 hours and it means that you will really start doing something for your goal the best step to start will be joining my closed chat find the link in the description under this video and write to me the code word private to my personal messages and i will add it to the closed chat and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel put your like write in the comments what you would like to see in the next episodes your questions your feedback everything and i'll see you next time